The gift that Ruth Williams gave us as transformed science at the College of Worcester, I think future science buildings are gonna to look to Williams as a guiding light, if you will. This is what we want to aspire to. Getting here at 7.30 in the morning, I'm always surprised at how many people are already here. Everyone can kind of either collaboratively work or sit right outside of the window and overlook the beautiful campus, which is great for a biology major like me, um, and it makes me feel comfortable in here. This building, I think, more symbolizes the way science has migrated to being much more of a collaborative affair. And this space, the way we've designed these spaces, is designed to enhance that. The way that the class is set up, we can move around and then there's whiteboards everywhere. And I really think like when they were building the spaces, they like thought about how students would use it and how professors can like bring components to the class so that the students can learn in different ways. Just looking at the labs and the write-up spaces and knowing how it invites learning in a relaxed way. That's just the kind of vibe that I got from the get-go. After working in a professional lab for the past two summers, it really did resemble that, but with even more resources in our labs than the professional labs I've worked in. You don't typically see that on a small campus with this scale with, I mean, I'm working on a $30,000 machine that we just got just for this year for my IS, and it's kind of surreal to be able to have that experience at a small school where we're still working side by side with our professors. It's a really different vibe and I really appreciate it because I actually feel like what I'm doing is real work. I'm not just trying to get IS done, I'm actually trying to do research and actually, you know, have an impact on other people. I think that by giving us this opportunity to design a space that fits what Worcester is and who Worcester is, that's just going to raise the bar on what type of work we do, what types of experiments are possible, what kind of opportunities can we give students, what skills can they acquire.